In this video, we'll balance the equation for Na2O2 plus Na. This is sodium peroxide. This is solid sodium. It's a metal. And then we get this sodium oxide as our product. I'm guessing that since these are both solids, you're heating them up, kind of melting them together. Maybe they would just react if you put them together. Either way, let's balance the equation. So if we count the sodiums up, we have two sodiums here. But don't forget we have the one sodium out here. So we have three sodium atoms then the two oxygens. Product side, two of the sodiums and just one oxygen. So I think what I'll do at first, I'm going to put a two here, the one times the two, that'll balance the oxygen atoms, and then two times two, that'll give me four of the sodium atoms. So I usually do oxygen last, but in this case, I knew that it would really change the sodiums. This is okay though, because right now I have two sodiums here and just one here. If I put a two in front of the sodium, now we have two plus, so two plus two, and that gives us four. This equation is balanced. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for Na2O2 plus Na. Thanks for watching.